Hello, my name is Casey Young and I'm currently studying film, history and English. And my name is Griffin Moore and I'm studying computer science and theater. And today we'll be showing you around reimagined Martin Hall. This beautifully designed building is an interdisciplinary center for technology and a social hub that serves all of Swarthmore's campus. It's home to the Film and Media Studies Department, the Computer Science Department, and the Creative Media Commons. Martin sits at the intersection of arts and sciences, campus and nature, and Swarthmore's past and future. It's apparent as soon as you enter the building. The front door was lowered, which makes Martin universally accessible, while still preserving the integrity of the historic 1930s exterior. Martin Hall was renovated with sustainability at its core. As part of 20 by 35, the college's ambitious energy plan for a carbon-free campus by 2035, the building is powered by our geo-exchange system in addition to solar panels on the roof. Plus, Martin's highly insulated and airtight building envelope helps maintain a stable temperature while using less energy. Its operations are estimated to use about 85% less energy than a comparable space. Martin also meets the rigorous standards of the Living Buildings Core certification. You'll see thoughtfully repurposed materials throughout the building. For example, around the grand central staircase, you'll see salvaged red oak wood and even the building's original metal chevron panels repurposed for their next chapter. As the new home of the Computer Science and Film and Media Studies departments, Martin Hall includes five new computer science classrooms with open layouts and movable furniture for maximum flexibility and collaboration. On the ground floor, the Ping and Rose Chen screening room is the perfect place for viewing everything from student films to studio features. This incredible 44-seat theater features a state-of-the-art surround sound system and the ability to screen films at their true aspect ratios, creating a cinematic experience for viewers and facilitating teaching and discussion. Along with the green screen room, Martin also has several video and audio editing suites open to students from all disciplines to use for multimedia projects both in and out of the classroom. Adding to Martin's amazing facilities, the Dr. Guy and Barbara Wong Creative Media Commons offers hands-on opportunities in digital storytelling, video production, motion graphics, animation, and photography. There are a variety of inviting places to sit and stay throughout this bright and airy building. 75% of Martin's non-performance spaces have ample natural light and beautiful views to the outside. And if you glance out the back windows, you'll notice specially designed exterior shades that block glare while allowing sunlight to pass through. To encourage interdisciplinary collaboration, department lounges serve as informal spaces for students and faculty members to connect, study, and socialize. Finally, this beautiful outdoor art plaza is the perfect place to gather or meet up with classmates and enjoy the natural beauty of campus. The Arts Plaza is a destination in itself, designed to host interdisciplinary arts and cultural events for the entire community. You'll also see a new, winding, and completely accessible walkway, the Peter Graham Swing Walk between Martin and the Lang Performing Arts Center. We thank you all so much for joining us on this virtual tour, and we hope you can come and see Martin Hall for yourselves.